Wednesday, Earth signs, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Sun, Rising, Mars, Jupiter, Frequencies, and um, Year of the Ox, Chinese Astrological Frequencies, Year of the Ox, Year of the Snake, Year of the Rooster, those with their moon frequencies and fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sag. Also, if you've got your Venus and or Mercury frequencies and air and water frequencies, also North Node in water frequencies, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This is your uh, neck, uh, card of the day energies for November 18, 2021. These messages may apply to you. Okay, of course, I will not be able to tap into everybody's everybody's Akashic record, um, but, you know, um, pretty much the urgent messages and um, those who need to hear these messages are for you. Okay, so um, you got the Nine of Cups, okay, and you know what I, I, I recently discovered? Before I continue, now this could mean something to you, water sign. Uh, you could be dealing with a water sign, but earth signs, or you could have water highly aspected. Okay, but also we got the full moon on Friday in the frequency of Taurus, um, which it will be actually that's going to be in the third deacon. Okay, if you let that mean something to you. Okay, it's like a Capricorn kind of vibe, so it's like full circle everything is coming full circle like a cycle is closing off capricorn represents saturn cycles and the moon itself represents cycles okay and for the numerology four which is cancer frequency is a complete cycle numer in a numerology kind of sense okay so I'm getting a, the, the closing off of a karmic cycle and with endings, which are closings, are, you know, new beginnings ushering in. Um, this could be where your work life is concerned, your reputation, your job, your marriage, your relationships, your relationship, well, relationships can be, you know, you know work relationships, you know, um, business partnerships, sexual partnerships, marriages, you know. Um, associations and stuff like that so I'm getting also you are just like becoming more and more articulate and more and more professional in whatever it is that you do because I feel a shift in my frequencies whilst doing this reading you're reading into your energy so I'm getting like really laid back and just really chill really professional and just really I'm getting like with this closing off it's like you know it's like this could be graduation for some of you okay or this could be a promotion but i feel like you i'm getting like easy breezy street okay that kind of frequency like it's not easy for other people but you've mastered something and so it's pretty easy for you you could do it with your with one eye closed you could do it with one arm one finger you could do it like it's like uh this video that my sons were showing me like it's like a kind of like funny video like um um it was like um what do they call them kind of um what do you call them stuff <sighs> like a sound off or something like it's like it was like your mom is so strong she defeated the hulk with her thumb so something like that you you know it's something that's so easy to you now but other people are in awe because it's like really difficult for them whatever it is that you have mastered so you could be receiving you're gonna be receiving a lot of compliments and this is gonna make you feel good okay um so i'm getting a lot of blessings on uh jupiter's day that is thursday november 18 of the astrovis and i'm getting you know just really feeling good i'm getting what you want also suddenly and this could also be in regards to an, an experiment but you know if you're a scientist or an astrologer or you know a researcher but i'm getting this could also be um money coming through you know wire transaction i am getting also um yeah so someone could be supporting you or donating to you like if you have a gofundme or if you you know you're on social media and influencer you accept donations i'm getting donations coming in now this is like not something that was expected 
anticipated but not so much anticipated or expected if you get what i mean you just pretty much did something and you know you're gonna be receiving you know um uh good results also um uh, i'm getting a sudden transition the death of this could be a baby um this is more like a baby so this is like a toddler or younger um yeah so the sudden transition of um so it's like i'm getting someone being overwhelmed here very emotional on thursday because of a sudden transition okay i'm getting if you um at some point you you dreamt of the death of a sibling like i'm getting something you saw in your sleep or in a in your dream state you saw someone transitioning someone dying now this could be a gemini or someone who's got gemini highly aspected or this could be an ex or this could be a sibling this varies for each of you this could be a step parent an in-law but this person who you saw in passing you saw them in the spiritual realm now this these kind of dreams and visions and travels they're really travels to the astral plane the spiritual realm um jumping timelines i i i spoke about i spoke about that um i think i do have a video uh did i do that video um but i i, I spoke about this in a video um dumping timelines um it's, it's pretty much a lot of people they have different definitions for dimensions all oh, you got 10 dimensions 11 but to me they're pretty much just three dimensions and dimensions are uh to me you know what has been revealed to me based on where I am in my journey is pretty much um, a point in time. Let me just simplify that dimensions are uh, dimensions. A dimension is time. Th dimension is time, period, dot, past, present, future. So if, whether you're in the past dimension, a past dimension, which they can be infinite. So you know it's just outside of you know their structure or their definition because defining is important um it's a form of guidance so which dimension what kind of dimension was it was it a past dimension present or future so that defines them but they're pretty much in finite dimensions like every second that passes is another dimension you get what i'm trying to say because that's a whole new whole different world so it's not really to say there's a set amount of dimensions they're infinite dimensions but what are they classic what what are the classifications okay there are three classifications because dimensions are time okay or dimension is time let me just yeah singular singularize that okay dimension is time and time is categorized by um experience which is past experience present experience future experience and so if you travel like into the future dimension not to go far of course and you saw like um someone in passing because like i spoke about this a lot of times especially last year um i i, I uh, i've seen a lot of people transitioning like um people who i yeah, so this could be a step parent, this could be a sibling, an ex, a spouse, a mother, but I'm getting like, or a father, but I'm getting like, this is like, someone saw someone, someone's death in their sleep, uh, when they, you know, they like travel to the future, pretty much that's what it is when you get like a prophecy or, or you see something in your sleep that eventually materializes that's you. You know in the past having jumped to the future dimension to see something that's like a gift and i'm getting like someone they saw something this could also be an aunt an uncle a cousin but i'm getting this person uh earth sign who you saw is they're gonna transition and um they're gonna die but this could also yeah that's like the closing off of the cycle there 
because I'm getting it is time it is time for them to it's time for them to move on I'm getting it is karmic justice however this is but or this is just 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 something as it's full circle it's it's, it's time So it's time for them to move on out of the physical, but I'm getting like this, this could be like an older, like an older family member, or this is like someone older than you, you are, okay? I'm getting like this family this this family member is not living with the family I'm getting like this family this this person whoever this is they live overseas no this could be they traveled overseas to work or they live overseas from you you don't live in the same country and I, it's not like like you're in the states and they're in a different uh, uh, state from you are. I'm getting like this person is like on a different continent, a different country, okay? But I'm getting like this person, like you're separated by water. I'm also getting sudden travel. Someone's gonna travel suddenly. Now this could be because you're gonna hear or get news of this death. So. Someone's gonna like pick up and travel suddenly. Okay. Or this could be this person, they're gonna fall gravely ill, very ill. And this is like you rushing to say your final goodbyes. Or to see them one last time. So I'm getting the closing off of a cycle here. Now this could be an accident, someone is going to, you know, or someone has been in a, a car accident or traveling, they had an accident. We like someone thought someone was recuperating, someone was going to get better, but like, I'm getting like in a weird case where this wasn't even that serious of a car accident, but someone over time, like a few days passed or a few weeks and they succumbed their injuries I'm getting like someone could have had internal bleeding unbeknownst to them as a result of the car accident I'm also getting um, a uh, an influencer or entertainer traveling overseas dying overseas not returning home okay so someone traveled overseas like this could be a local entertainer but they're not going to return home. This person, they are going to die overseas. Uh, so these are Thursday's messages. Um, let me see if I... I if there's anything else I'm getting um, an overdose I'm getting I'm also getting that energy someone overdosing like this is like something that someone this could be something that someone they have to take um, or something that was prescribed to them by the doctor they're gonna overdose on that drug but this could be drugs hard drugs that this person they have been taking and uh, they're gonna overdose themselves on this um, like they're gonna take too much on Thursday and it's gonna they're gonna OD um, I'm getting traveling to support someone here 
telling, you know, this is like going to see someone, reaching out, going to someone, going out, like reaching out to someone like this could be to support them financially, reaching out to help them. I am also getting someone becoming a spirit guide. I'm also getting like, um, someone is going to see, um, the spirit of, this could be a lover, or this, this Gemini, this is someone who's got Gemini highly aspected, or this could be a step parent, or this could be your sibling. I'm not really getting this as like a mother. I'm getting this is more like a sibling, um, a cousin, a step parent, an ex. Like this person, they're gonna transition, and when they transition, they're gonna come to see you. They're gonna pay you a visit, Earth sign. You're gonna see this person. You're gonna see their ghost. The ghost of your ex. Fan, fan, phantom lover. Phantom lover. Where did I hear that um, term or phrase? Phantom lover. The ghost of your ex. But this person, they're going to travel to see you. Their spirit is going to travel to see you. And they're going to talk to you like normal like this person can like talk to you like normal but it's actually a ghost and i'm also getting it's so weird because i feel like maybe you're not gonna realize this person is dead this is like getting so eerie But I feel like, like, if, like, I feel like this person, you're talking this, to this person and you think that, like, everything is normal, you, you're, you're unaware that they're dead, but I feel like, like, halfway or whilst talking to them, like, all of a sudden, you realize you're actually talking to a ghost, you're seeing a ghost. I feel like that is going to really change your life. I don't know who this is for, but this is like someone who met you when you were a child. Now, you might not remember this meeting or you may have fragments of this meeting. But during your adult life, you came to meet this person again. But you were not aware that that, that was the same person who you met when you were a kid. It was like they were interviewing you or they were like getting to know you. And they, I, like, it, was this for the earth? No, it was for the air signs for today's uh, re reading. For today's energies, is today's message. Like, like this could be like, like you, I don't know. You could have aspects there, but then again, air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This could be someone who has Gemini highly aspected, whether sun, moon, rising, north node, Venus, Mars. But this person, they have Gemini highly aspected. As well as this could just be like a... Or you're of the tiger. I want to say any air frequency because they're deacons to consider. But I'm just stuck on Gemini. But of course, this could be an X. I'm getting this could also be someone who you're currently talking to like a lover like this person they're gonna die transition and you're unaware that that damn this person is dead you know i got for the fire signs a death wish now i'm gonna like somebody could have like done something now i don't know if i should say this I don't know. So weird. I, I, I don't know, but I'm just going to say it. Like, someone could have caused this person's death or something. Like, this could be like 
he never thought it would have materialized. But at the end of the day, I'm getting it was all meant to be. Now this could be a, a dream you had and like, you never really thought that you were gifted to really see the future. You never thought it would really happen. It is gonna happen. Or you have a way of manifesting things through your thoughts. You never thought you really had that gift. Now, what you manifested, this could also be a nephew, a niece, but whatever it is you manifested, or you envisioned is gonna manifest or is manifesting it's so crazy I'm gonna let someone who's really gifted in the mind so um, I'm gonna leave it there before I start hyperventilating again like like I did you know at you know the air signs and had to like and like so even though it was so long it was like telling a story, a never ending story. So, um, as is for you, like you, the real esoteric aspect of this, is like just a few people are at that point in their spiritual journey. That's the synchronicity. I'm using that as a guide, as the storage. So, I'm gonna leave it there. I'm getting like someone like. Yeah, someone's gonna see someone. The death. If someone's gonna see, someone can see death before it happens. I'm getting. You could have spoken this into being, or you said, or you told someone, or you told people. You that about you told people about this dream or vision me and they probably didn't believe but they're now going to believe you like thursday like jupiter frequency sagittarius frequency they're going to see and getting this person could already be around you but like the full moon getting closer to the full moon in taurus that's going to aid them physically appearing to you. So I'm going to leave it there, guys. The mistake is signs. I'm also getting, getting um, some of you will be getting what you want. You're going to see this dream manifest. Now, this for some of you is where it, as it is. This could be something you wanted. But something's going to manifest. I'm getting like really getting what you want for some of you now um i'm getting traveling to someone's home suddenly all of a sudden i'm getting also sexual intercourse so um if you're going to travel to see a lover all of a sudden this is like um hiding from the public's eyes just like chilling back just you know just in the house just making sweet passionate love to each other like over and over again so that's a good good way to end this that's for someone you know or you know i don't know a few people so that's good hopefully it'll be good for you <laughs> okay i'm gonna leave it there in a mistake